Chapter 10 Export Import STL File from SSA to Civil 3D. This chapter you will review the process of exporting a STM file from SSA and the process of moving the pipe network to Civil 3D. In this chapter you'll learn about exporting an STM file from SSA, set Civil 3D storm sewer migration defaults, and import an STM file into Civil 3D. Before beginning this chapter, run the Chapter 10 Setup file. Select the Chapter 10-220495552.exe file. Double click on it to run the WinSEP self extractor. Browse to the C drive and select the Civil 3D Projects directory and click OK. Next, click Unzip. This will override any existing files in this project folder. Click OK, exit out of the WinZip extractor. Next, locate the Autodesk Storm and Sanitary Analysis icon on your desktop. Double click on it to launch. After SSA is launched, open the project. Select the File pull down menu, choose Open. Browse to your Civil 3D Projects directory. Go to the folder 2209-2204955201, Drainage, and SSA. Next, select Drainage SR61, Final. Select Open. Click the File pull-down menu and hover over Export and select HydroFlow Storm Sewers File. Browse to the SSA folder under the Drainage folder and create a new file called Propose Drainage SR61 Export from SSA. Click Save. When the Autodesk Storm and Sanitary Analysis dialog box comes up, click the Yes button to save the log file. Use the default name created by the program, save an SSA folder, and click Save. View the log file on the Log File tab. After done viewing the log file, close SSA and save the changes to the project. Pipe networks from the HydroFlow Storm Sewer STM file format to Civil 3D can contain hydraulic property information, such as hydraulic grade lines, or HGL, and energy grade lines, otherwise known as EGL, which is part of the reason why we use SSA for better analysis of our design. The following values are calculated in the Storm Sewer Extension version 2010 and beyond, but are not found in older versions of STM files prior to 2010. Pipes, energy grade line up, energy grade line down, flow rate, and for structures, energy grade line and known capacity. In the Storm Sewer Extension, the list of pipe sizes is hard-coded and cannot be customized. This list does not distinguish between inner and outer pipe diameter, pipe material, or pipe class, as does AutoCAD Civil 3D. Matching network names and part names. When you import the .stm file, if any of the pipe network names in the .stm file match pipe network names in the AutoCAD Civil 3D drawing, you must choose to either create new pipe networks or update existing pipe networks. Rules are not applied to pipes or structures when importing pipe networks from either LAN XML or the HydroFlow Storm Sewers STM file format. As a beneficial workflow, we will save, 
we will save as the existing drawing with a new name so we can preserve the content that existed prior to editing in SSA and compare that to the revised pipe network data that returns from SSA to Civil 3D, overriding the existing data that matches the part names of incoming data. Exercise 11.1 .1. Open and save as the DRP RRD06 DWG file. Start Civil 3D by double clicking on the F.Civil 3D state kit icon on your desktop. After F.Civil 3D is launched, click on the application pull down menu in the top left hand corner and choose the open option. Next, make sure you're on your local disk C, click on Civil 3D projects, the project number, select the drainage folder. Make sure the files of type show DWG. Then, select the DRPRRD06 drawing and select Open. Once the drawing is open, once again click on the Application Options and choose Save As. At the end of the name, take away the 6 and place a 7. Replace it with 7. Then click Save. If you notice on top of the application user interface, you'll now see the drawing has been renamed. Exercise 11.2 Set Civil 3D Storm Sewer Migration Defaults Pipe networks imported from the Storm Sewer extension can contain hydraulic property information such as hydraulic grade lines HGL and energy grade lines EGL. First, let's edit the feature settings. In the tool space, select the settings tab. Right click on pipe network and select edit feature settings. Select the allow part family swapping to know and use imported part ID for family part to number, then click OK. Next, import the STM file into Civil 3D. Locate the Insert tab. Next, select Import Select the Storm Sewers command. Browse to the SSA folder in your project. Here, select the final proposed drainage SR61 export from SSA.stm. Click Open. Select Update the existing pipe network option. No errors are displayed in the event viewer. Next, grip pipe-6 and select the pipe properties command in the ribbon. The hydraulic properties have been updated. The inner pipe diameter is now 24 inches.
Click OK to close the dialog box. Grip Inlet S-12 and then click Structure Properties. Select Structures and then Pipe Networks Tree. Select S-12, right click and choose Zoom To. Select the S-12 structure and then select Structure Properties. On the, pop, on the Part Properties tab, scroll down to the Hydraulic Properties. Notice the Hydraulic Grade Line and Energy Grade Line are now populated with calculated values imported from SSA. Click OK and then press Escape to clear the grips. Save the file and then close Civil 3D.